Hey guys, welcome back to Twitchy Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown, where last time we had a terror mission in Mexico, I believe, and look at how much panic is not now on the North American continent. I think that is amazing. But we have a few things coming up that we need to watch out for, more, uh, most particularly this council report. So we, we've got to watch out and see what's going to go on with that, but shall we just go to our mission control and, and scan through some time? We want to see what this council report has to say for us. I, some yellow text popped up and missed out what that was. We have a request from Japan. They want some nanofiber vests. And they're only going to give us 57. Maybe we can do that. Maybe we don't. Let, let's go and have a look. We're in engineering. We want to build stuff. Nanofiber. We, we've got two. Yeah, we can we can do this. We can we can build another two. Insufficient funds to go any higher than that. But that's fine because this should be making us. Oh no. Okay. Oh, I see what's going. Oh, ooh. oh, right. Okay, are we that short of funds, are we? So let's go to the uh, the the situation room here. Get to the grey market. Maybe sell another two of those. I'm hoping. Like, I, I've not found a serious use for the float of corpses yet, so th this should be fine. We want to manufacture two of those. Yep, we can. Cool. This is good. So 22, that's going up to 57. That will be amazing. So in the situation room here, we have the pending request and we can just do that. Boom. Job done. Look at that. No, it's not much of an increase in money, but it is enough to get going. Uh, back into the mission control. We've got our light plasma rifle about to be ticked over, so this should be interesting. We need to get all these built, but I don't think we're going to be able to do that until after the council report, which is thankfully just about to come up we only need to make five of them after all uh into that in addition to manufacturing our own light plasma rifles our shoulders soldiers should now be able to use any to recover from the battlefield great and the light plasma rifle is available awesome we will be making some of these but first we need to figure out what we're going to make first uh i'm always up for armor but as you can see it is quite slow uh the plasma cannon's looking pretty short uh yeah short in time the plasma cannon's all right the plasma rifle why is this Okay, it's going to cost us a lot of stuff, I think. But let's go for this one. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Well, the worst that could happen is we needed the other thing, uh, and then we're getting caught a little bit short. But let's see what the council says of us this time. I've got a feeling they're going to say we we're much impressed. impressed. Yeah, look at that. Progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Thank you. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. For the fourth month and in a row. That is not a statement this council makes lightly. You just keep making it, though. You might not make it lightly, but you do keep making it. Uh, so we've got an A. 685 monies. That's not bad. I'm sure, like, our... Um, maintenance costs are going to take most of that away but there we go we've launched a satellite we've shot down a, a ufo <laughs> we've completed so many pro projects that's quite cool okay we've raided a single U ufo remember we will be watching yes and as i say every month remember i will be watching you okay so we've got first of july okay let's get to engineering New engineers arrived this morning commander we're always glad to have more help down here Laser sniper, no, the late light plasma rifle. What? We've got three already. Uh, this lightweight function uh, rifle functions on the same principle as all our other plasma weaponry. Uh, this doesn't help me know whether this is what I want to give to people. Let's come back here. Let's go to our barracks. Hello, Mr. Soldiers. Let's have a look at. I don't know who who is going to be using the plasma rifle. Let, let's go and have a look at Doc. Hey, Doc. What's going on with you, man? This thing. Oh look, like three light plasma rifles. What's what's the weapon output? What what are we looking at here? Base damage five, crit seven, with a ten percent crit chance. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Base damage five, seven, ten, ranged medium. Okay, so what's Is it me or are they exactly the same? Medium five, ten, seven. Oh, carries a ten percent aim bonus. Ah, what are you doing? What are you doing? You wanna look at that? Okay, so Plasma is a little bit easier to aim with, it turns out. Uh, who else do we have on our team that would use a sniper, not a sniper rifle, a laser thing? I'm not sure, actually. I'm not sure because, like, our heavies use uh, scatter lasers, our assaults use... No, other way around. But you, you know what I'm saying. N none of these really use it apart from the supports. Which is a bit rubbish, really. Well, well, we'll find out next time that we are trying to build stuff. Uh, let's get back on to building the satellite nexus, because this is one of the things that I really wanted to do. And I think I just saw Marquez is come back onto active duty, so that'll be pretty cool. Well, will you look at this? 
two dishes pointing around in a very funny manner. All right, let's uh, let's get a new construction on the go if we can. We've got a lot of money, so this should be good. Thermo generator is going to be next round. That's good. Look at all this. Isn't that great? Um, so we have power there. What are we going to put in this spot? This is the thing. Uh, now, obviously, the hyperwave relay is going to be one of the things going in, but I would really like to get this psionics lab put in first. Um, the only thing we need is power. Um, which should be coming up fine. The Illyrium uh, generator, this is nice. Uh, Illyrium power generators supply 30% power. Ah, uh, so I need to put this... Ah, so this uses Illyrium. Mmm, okay. Well, we, we might use that at some point. We might even rip down, you see these old power generators and put an Illyrium one in. I'm not sure if that's what we want to be doing. Let me know, guys. Let me go. Let me know. Okay, so let's uh, come back out of here. I don't think we wanted to be building any facilities at this point in time. I don't think so, anyway, as we have a thermal generator also being built. Maybe now we'll have something that we want to build. I'm hoping. Wow, number two, getting rather close to the hot stuff there. Let's, let's come on down, build the facilities. Uh, now, we were talking about the psionics lab, right? Let's do it. What, what, what do we have to lose, hey? Well, 200 creds but that should be fine. This maintenance on this facility will cost 30. That's fine as well. Okay, so we're just gonna wait for that to happen. I've not dealt with Psyonix before in this game, so we will see what's going on. Uh, yeah, if you're not quite aware, this is my first blind playthrough, so we will see what's going on with that. We've got plasma cannon being built, we've got Psyonix labs and council report. I've got a feeling we are just about to meet with some contact though. Uh, we are over Russia, this should hopefully uh, you know, get some real serious things on the go. Do we try the Phoenix Cannon or do we try the, the Avalanche? Let's go for the Phoenix Cannon. I didn't see what type of um, UFO it was. It, it, well, this could be anything. UFO number five, though. Uh, and we're coming in for Enemy an attack. Okay, I've, once again, I've not put any of these satellites in. Maybe I should uh, get that going. The damage is all right. We, we seem to be dodging all right. Maybe, hopefully, we can take this down. Uh, oh, God. Oh, that was That was damaging. That was seriously damaging. But we are at the point where we are ready to launch to take on a UFO, which I think will be okay. Uh, so we've got two heavies. Marquez is not using his laser. Is he not? I thought he would be. What's going on here? No, he's not. LMGs. What happened to my uh, scatter, scatter pistol? Scatter laser? No, that's not it. Laser rifle? I'm sure there was a heavy laser somewhere. I'm sure there was a heavy laser somewhere. Let's go back and let's have a look. Oh, what Eugene Rue is using. Hey, let's have a look at the loadout. You also do not have the heavy laser rifle. What's what's going on with this? Is there another one somewhere that has stolen all our stuff? Um, it's not going to be Nakagawa. It's not going to be... Oh, look, maybe it's this girl here. Can we uh, come across here? Hello? Yes. Heavy, heavy, heavy. We don't need this many heavies, do we? So let's edit this unit here. Hey, you don't want that. And you don't want that. There we go. Uh, rocket launcher, arc thrower. Do we pull the arc thrower out? Can we do that? Can we just remove it? I don't think we can. Let's use a frag grenade then. Boom. Job done. Um, what can happen? So, you are going to disappear. Hey, and we're going to bring Pedersen back into active duty. Hey, how's it going, girl? You, you, you looking good? You doing fine? Everything going fine? It should be. Scatter raised laser. That's good. Uh, or do we want the plasma pistol? Hmm, it's, it's a thought, isn't it? It is a thought. And what's going on down here? A bit of chicken plating. Awesome. That is exactly what we want. So we can get in close and shoot them with the scatter laser. Okay, so that's that. There's these three ready to go. Um, Rue and Odin. Okay, now Odin is the one we want to make sure it gets the fully tasty one of these. Maybe we want to build another heavy laser, if at all possible. Maybe get the, uh, the heavy plasmas on the go but I think this should do for them here and oh I'm not sure about this guy let's let's have a look there's not much we can do apart from make another LMG so should we do that what have we got on here okay this looks this looks good so let's go back we can do this we can do this we go to engineering we go to build and we have a look at the uh, heavy laser do we only have the one that we can do yeah it's a, it's a little bit a little bit annoying I'm, I'm, I'm sure but let's do it job done says we've got a plasma pistol here i would like to give one to nakagawa there we go right let's go and make sure these things happen as we have just intended it to happen i'm hoping i'm really hoping 
Colonel Nakagawa, edit unit. Hey, loadout. Pistol, plasma pistol. Job done. There we go. It's been it's been so long we've been trying to do this and now it's finally happened. Yeah. Okay, and this is the final bit that we needed to do before we could actually go over there. Before we can actually get out to the, the, the site. Let's go. Wow. Been a while. Been a while. But let's get flying. Uh so we don't really have a name for our pilot. I've noticed this is one thing. Like we don't we haven't made any sort of rapport with this guy. Uh, let's, let's, let's get on here. I mean, we, we see this. Russia. This is always this hollow targeting at the front here. I don't know if this is hollow target. Like this hollow screen at the front here. Um, if there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay. No, clear. we're never going to see any. We're never going to see any civilians, are we? Okay, coming in for a landing. Look, look how close they get us every time. I, these guys are good, and we just don't. We don't even know who they are. Central Pilot Central one, well done. Strike one is ready to secure the craft. Copy, big sky. Strike one is clear to attempt the breach. Five, five, five. Uh, okay, so where are we going to send Kobayashi? I reckon he's going to come just straight here. Who's? Oh, we've spotted someone already. Have we actually spotted someone already? Where Where was that? Over there. Look at that mutons. That's no good. That's no good. We're just going to Overwatch. We want to try and get out of this way. Uh, Nakagawa could possibly see them and shoot them from up back here. Let's um. Let's get someone else up who can do said thing. If we come over here, we should be able to see them. No, no, still not seeing. Okay, well, this, that's fine. That's fine. As long as nothing serious goes down, we should be all right. I'm hoping. I'm hoping, eh? Uh, and Marquez can go on this side, and hopefully we should have a nice spread out. And Nakagawa is just going to sit on Overwatch with his plasma plasma rifle. Maybe at some point we'll, we'll do something more more useful with him. Let's see what these guys are going to do. Hopefully they're coming in close. What was this? What's this? What's going on all the way over there? I don't want nothing to do with that. No one wants nothing to do with that. Oh, is this a dead end up this way and actually the uh, UFO's this way? Well, let's let's try and take on these, um, what are these called? Mutons. They, no, have they moved? They have, they've moved. How terribly inconsiderate of them. Look, there's a tree all the way back here. No idea. Ah, look. I was about to say, I have no idea where the UFO is, but we can just about make out its shadowy form back there. Uh, let's go and clear the UFO out first, as per normal. We can see what's going on and just deal with it as as we can deal with it. Uh, shouldn't really have moved Nakagawa so far forwards, but let's give him his plasma pistol. Plasma pistol. And he can overwatch. That's great. Pedersen, where are you going to go? You can't really hide behind a burning bush um, as much as I would like you to. And over here is a little bit exposed, I think. So can we possibly move her down? Next? Oh, it's a bit close. It's a bit close, but we're gonna gonna do it anyway. Uh, Eugene Rue, I don't, I don't like the fact that I've got everyone kind of bunching up, but there's not much I can do at this sort of range. Um, I, this is why I hate doing operations out in the in the wilds it's just so exposed there's not really much I can do let's see what they do uh, there is a lot more they can do than what I can do I'm, I'm, I'm expecting oh god here we go what, what is all this stuff just over this way this is not really what we want is it um, okay so Kobayashi is going to come in all the way down here yeah, nothing going on down there. It's a little bit annoying. I was kind of hoping to have found someone by then. Uh, Nakagawa is just straight up not going to move until he knows what is going on. Uh, maybe we can get some people along here. This should be good. I mean, a couple of heavies, a couple of assaults, and a... Are we full on missing a support? Oh. Oh, we are full on missing a support, aren't we? Oh, this could be bad. And also, I've just put him in completely the wrong spot. But we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. This could be very bad, actually. Um, but, yeah. Just going to have to roll with it. There's not much else we... Oh, no. Firing. There's not much else we can do. Uh, and Nakagawa, get to your plasma pistol... Uh, not your plasma pistol, your sniper rifle, and see what's going on. Watch the world around us and make sure that you, know, you can take a shot at anyone that comes even close to my boys. And girls. I'm, I'm really annoyed that it keeps showing me this stuff over here. I don't, I don't really, I don't really care. I've, I've only really got one, one target in mind at the moment. And that's to make sure that the uh, UFO is cleared out. Unless the UFO is absolutely like huge, 
if it, if it is like massive then we're not really going to have much opportunity to do better things oh wow look at this okay let's go over this way these guys are really getting quite thinly spread we should try and um get back together a little bit more i mean we're not not dangerously spread but we are definitely spread out that like two people can't back each other up and that is not really what we're going for is it we, we want to be able to get everyone backed up and doing goodness my goodness uh nakagawa you're just going to come in and hide behind this bit here maybe get up onto the the land at some point oh yeah oh we could we could dash him we could dash him and then he's just useful next round right uh but we can't well we, we could but we're not going to because it's very much a silly move uh i'm not sure if what i've done is a silly move like especially having these four here and then um marquette's so far away did you hear something no uh I, I just... What is that noise? What what is it? What is it actually doing? What's? Contact. I don't know. We'll have to see. It's not carrying a weapon like the others. What could it be doing? I don't know. What could everything here be doing? They're protecting stuff. Are they? Are they protecting stuff? They're, they're going for hiding. Kobayashi is taking reaction shot. It's too far away. What was that other thing? Did anyone see that thing that fluttered up here? I saw something flutter up. Pedersen's... Uh, the thing is, all these guys are taking their reaction shots from so far away that their weapons just cannot work. Uh, hopefully Nakagawa can do something about this. Uh, let's let's have a look. Why are, why are we going all the way over there? Hey. So what? Have we, who have we got? We've got him who we don't want, but him, he's someone we definitely want to take out. He's not carrying a weapon, so should we try the headshot? There we go. 85% chance to hit. 50% critical damage. That's a shame. I was kind of hoping for a little bit more. Oh, what's he doing? What are you doing, mate? He's charging at me. I'm not sure why he's charging at me. Why did he charge? Is that, is that Nakagawa done? Can we fire again? Double tap, right? Double tap. Hopefully. Okay, well, that's a good start. Definitely a good start. Who have we got next? Britt Pedersen. Where is Britt? He's coming closer to me. Why? How can you be doing this stuff? Uh, let's just fire eight, 90 percent hit, surely. We just gotta try and take him out. I'm worried. I'll be honest. I'm very worried. Now, damn, it, now. damn it, Brett! What are you do? Oh, well, there we go. That took care of that trouble. Uh, not quite as like smooth as we'd like. But it definitely took care of that trouble. Let's move up Mr. Roo. Uh, maybe take a firing shot. If not at him, at him over there. 38% though. It's not great. Oh, well, there we go. We only had to hit him with one bit of... One bit of... Um, well, just one bit of anything. One bit of damage. One bit of hits. One bit of everything. 25%. Uh, I don't know why I clicked that. I was supposed to be going for... Uh, what's the other one? Overwatch. Well, we'll see what he's doing. Hopefully he's not going to throw a grenade. As that would... Oh, look at all those other things back there. I think we're just going to have to kind of hunker down and let them come to me and we'll see what happens. I mean, look at this over here. What's, what's all this? I mean, to me, it looks like a, a rocket excuse. Mm. Okay, she's panicked. That's fine. Could be how she can come down here. Could really do with better, better cover. Actually, uh, maybe what we'll do is actually run and gun. Okay, just just to cover my poor move and then go back into this kind of full cover spot. Uh, so Nakagawa, seventy-five percent hit chance. That would be nice if we can actually hit. There we go. That's what we're talking about. This is why I bring the snipers. Yeah, uh, Eugene Rue, Can we? fire at this guy 38 percent chance not great but hopefully it's going to be enough to it. no that's that is a shame that is a shame uh maybe we can come over this way we can't fire a rocket but can we fire a 55 percent chance to hit ah come on what's wrong with you we took loads of shots at him all we had to do was take one oh 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 no we're all good we're all good. It could have been dangerous. It could have been really dangerous. Now, what's he going to do? Is he going to also fire a long-distance shot? Hopefully also missing. That was close. That was close. That was close. Oh, God. Look what we got coming in here. 
why have we got coming in here? I, I, I full on actually don't know what we've got coming in here. Um, let's move in closer, because that's always a good move. And fire, not at him, but at him over there. 53%. Like, we've, we've taken a lot of 50% chances. Surely one of them's got to work at some point. Surely one of them has got to work at some point. That's just a single shot. We don't want to do that. Or oh, maybe we do. Maybe we do. Let's try it. Oh. Okay, that's good. Does he get his double tap? He doesn't get his double tap. That's a little bit unfortunate, but that's the way it is. We're going to have to move her in, do a bit of a reload. Damn it, Eugene Rue actually has to reload. Uh, Marquez can get in closer, though. Let's come over here. Hopefully he's now got rid of the flank. No. What are we shooting for? 25% hit. We're, we're probably going to reload as well. He may take some hits from this because he is so exposed, but we'll, we'll see. Is he just running away? Is he full on running away? I don't mind if you run away, mate. Like, you can do that. It just seems a little bit silly. Ha, <laughs> suppressed. Yeah, right. Okay. Uh, we're going to have to use Nakagawa to do some more extreme stuff. Like, I'm worried about a cyber disc flying in. There is a lot of back and forth thing going on here. Look at that. I didn't do any of these things. What? Uh, suppress. 27% chance to hit. But with an 80% critical, maybe we can get the critical chance. Oh, yeah. I'm not I'm not sure whether you need to hit before you can do a crit or what. Um, but we're going to take a moment to reload Nakagawa. Um... Pedersen can come down this way. We're going to go line up for the door. Ah, would you look at that. Do you reckon we can run and gun somewhere a bit closer? Oh, hit the wrong button. Run and gun. Uh, maybe up here and then shoot him in the face. If we're lucky. If we're lucky. 96% chance to hit. 8% critical. Ah, really wanted that crit. That crit would have been incredibly useful. Okay, Eugene Rue, can you come down here and also do the same? Hopefully, fire. Oh, 58%. There we go. Right. Feeling a little bit safer now. Feeling a little bit safer now. So let's just come down and... Uh, should we, like, try and take over the base? Kind of makes sense, really, doesn't it? If we, if we take over the uh, the UFO, we can then use it as a base of operations to fight these guys, whoever these lot are. Where are they come from? Oh, hey. You seem to be, like, totally at my exposed rear. Mm, it's not it's not useful really is it it's not really useful uh, so what we need to do actually oh god is uh oh god <laughs> maybe run Nakagawa all the way up here can he do that he can do that right let's just get him out of there ah guys they're coming for me ah <laughs> oh excuse me right that, that was a little bit a little bit scary a little bit scary uh, I'm gonna dive behind here so we can protect ourselves Okay, we're going to hit Overwatch and see what goes on. Uh, Eugene Rue, can you... No, you can't even spot them. That's fine. That's fine. I was wondering if he could fire a rocket and then everything would be all right. Uh, Marquez is also going to come down here, possibly hide on this side, maybe. Uh, I'm thinking. We'll, we'll see. We'll see what comes up. Uh, could be our sheet. Now, we could send him down to start like handling out some punishment, but I don't think that's quite the way forwards. Um, maybe let's come down here, start heading towards this door. It should all be fine as long as we remember our training, right? This is what it's all about, remembering training. Uh, let's just hop on the other side of this here and overwatch. I think we're doing alright for most of our weapons and stuff. Let's see if they come in any closer. Hopefully they do, because I could really do with having a defensive position to take them on from. That would be very nice. Uh, Nakagawa, I can't see anyone. That's fine. I think I'm going to leave him here not seeing anyone. Uh, Eugene Rue. I don't really want to... So I know they're here somewhere. Do I, do I want to go back and have a look and then maybe use Nakagawa? Yeah, look at that. Okay, so let's take a holo targeting. Ooh, even better got some damage on them as well and then with there we go look at that hopefully this will do amazingly well 
There we go. That's what we're talking about. There's some tactics right there. Yeah. Okay, so we've got some more to worry about later. But let's move these guys in. Um, just to see what's going on. Just to see what's going on. Hopefully nothing is going on. If all is fine, then all is fine. What's this? Oh, it's just a bit of slime. It's fine. Or as we call it now, alien blood. Anyone else got to go? Anyone else got to go? Show us the alien activities. Alright, Kobayashi. Hmm. Let's not do that. Let's use Rue here to try and find the other guy. Where do you reckon he is? Do you reckon we've got too much further to move up before we spot him? No, that's a bit, oh, a bit not alright to be fair. Okay, Marquez, you are... You are moved? Are you moved? You're moved. Let's, let's do that, okay. Uh, Kobayashi. Is it because he had to run around all that, actually? Uh, that's a shame. Um, Kobayashi can go duck into the corner there. We're going to move Eugene Rue back, I think. I think we will. Um, it's going to take his next go, of course, but Overwatch with the sniper rifle. Pedersen might even start making our way down this way. Let's see what we can see. Ah, oh, looking through there would actually be useful. But we are here, so this is what's going to happen. We're going to have to stick here. Whew, alien scum, bring it. We can hear stuff. Are they? Wow, that was a terrible shot. I can't even see who was trying to shoot at me. If that was a shot, that was just the worst. Okay, Kobayashi, you know what, mate? Come and stand here. Let's see what we can see. Nothing? Nothing to spot at? It's a little bit of a shame. That is a little bit of a shame. Nakagawa can stay there on the Overwatch. Yeah. Pedersen, you going to go up and see what's behind this door? I mean, what's the worst that can happen, eh? What is the worst that can happen? Anything to report? Nothing to report. Okay, we're going to just overwatch at this door. Uh, maybe we'll go the other way with Kobayashi, maybe not. Uh, Eugene Rue is definitely going to be working back towards this area, though. Maybe actually a dash? Should we just leave our sniper um, ready to, to take on all comers? That's the plan, anyway. Right, so we can't just climb over this. Maybe I'll just do a dash as the last last part of this movement, just to, to get him into a useful position. Hopefully something will expose itself. Nakagawa will now shoot at it. No? Is that is that not what's going to happen? Nakagawa. Oh, no, that's root. There we go, Nakagawa. Um, if you fire, what do you get? A 95% chance hit. What if I do a headshot? Let's try that instead. Hopefully this is enough to take him down. Rubbish camera angles, though. What is this? Okay, that that's nice and useful. Uh, Pedersen's going to come around to this door now. And wait there. We're not even going to open it. We're just going to wait, ready to go. Uh, Eugene Ru, uh, can you get down in here? Hopefully Nakagawa can now follow us and everything will be safe and sound. Um, we seem to be done outside. We seem to be done with the outside. Is it quiet? Is it good? Is it secret? Is it safe? I think it's secret and safe. All the uh, UFO power cores are pretty messed up, I know. It's a little bit annoying. A little bit annoying. Uh, I am going to run and gun over here. No, 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 no. Run and gun. Okay. At the speed of death. Over here. Brilliant. Shame we can't do a, a reload after this. I'll just put him in position and reload. But, yeah. There we go. This is what we do. This is what we do. Uh, maybe someone will expose themselves. Maybe someone won't. We can hear stuff from over here. So it might be here. It might be further back. But I know one thing. We are going to definitely find out. Uh, where can I put him that's just like inside? There we go. Let's, let's go hide. Let's go stand there. Do we see anything? We don't see anything. Okay. Well, that's the way it has to be sometimes. Can't overwatch. There we go. Wow, Nakagawa, you are distance out, my friend. I'm going to run you down here. Maybe we could have put him on top of the uh, the UFO, thinking about it. Maybe we could have, but we didn't, so we won't. Uh, we're going to move Pedersen here. Do we see anything? Anything particularly scary? No, we're going to overwatch. Okay. Uh, Mr. Rue, okay, you can come down here and, oh wow, I've just realised I've grouped like three of them up together. We can still move Marquez, but it's just not, oh no, this is Marquez, uh, it's just not ideal, you know, it's 
just not ideal. Right, let's see if anything comes running out of this door into the full fury of all our explosives. I doubt it though. I doubt it. Um, of course, by explosives I do mean the bullets we use. Uh, I mean, what else would I use? Okay, Marquez, you're going to go in first because you get horror targeting on shit. Enemy what do we see? We see two commanders. This is not great. Hopefully we can carry on aiming at them. Fire. Oh yeah, why not this one? What's the other one? 48, 58. Let's just fire. Let's see what we get. That's a miss there. Maybe... Oh, it could be I actually can't actually get in and I don't have a run and gun. Hmm, that's a little bit annoying, hey? That is a little bit annoying. Let's use Pedersen to pop this door. Now what's your best chance of firing at people? 74, 92, yeah. We'll take that. Ah, oh, sweet, that's what we're after. Uh, right, who else can we move up? Eugene Rue, maybe we could pop him. Mm, I don't like it, I don't like it. Let's pop him over here. Uh, no, oh, <laughs> that's not where I wanted. I wanted you in the corner. But now you are completely exposed. Um, let's just fire some shots at him to try and ease it up. And Kobayashi can't even do a run and gun. Um, oh, guys, it's, it's annoying. It's very annoying. Um, no, we can't can't even get to a point where we can see. So I'm just going to do a dash. We're just going to have to kind of deal with whatever it is that happens here. Uh, can Nakagawa squad sight it? He can't. <laughs> That's annoying. What's the furthest dash you can perform, though? Down here. Let's do it. Let's get Nakagawa in on the game. Maybe he'll be able to do some beautiful things. Maybe this guy will take over someone and then everyone's dead. I don't know. We'll just see. Oh, 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 oh. Damage is real, my friends. Damage is real. Though it is kind of the first bit of damage. Right, so let's get Marquez in. We're going to fire for the holo targeting, 48%. This should be fine, hopefully. Brilliant. And now we have two assault people who can just kind of one to him so let's run up here <laughs> this best work 100% hit 8% critical chance wow end of mission Everything by the booyah what a mission that was indeed clearing you out UFOs we're getting quite good at it now um I was a little surprised that those people were like outside those people those mutons were outside coming in round to flank the back of us interesting but that's the way it is we possibly should have captured the Muton Excellent. without the around. weapons. And that was an impressive effort from our troops. Thank you very much. And I noticed that it was only our armor that actually took any damage. But Kobayashi is uh, leveled up to captain. Uh, confers a reaction shot against any enemy who closes in within four tiles. and don't need to be on Overwatch. That's quite good. So people that just get close get, get muddled. Um, yeah, I'm going to go with that one. Confirm. Brilliant. And who else? Eugene Rue Tank. Doesn't really look much like a tank, does he? Uh, shredder rocket or suppression? We're going to give him suppression on this one, just because. There we go. Because we've got a shredder rocket, and we never really make use of it with uh, with Marquez. So we've got the berserker autopsy ready to do. Probably should have tried to capture the berserker, as we say. But look at all this stuff we've got, and including some damage stuff that we can sell on, which is always nice. Should we do the selling right now, just so we like remember about it? Bop 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 bop, uh, and another one. Complete the transaction, bow, monies. And with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time when we're going to deal with the next savage threat against our planet. Bye!